Who are you? Kay Brace? I gotta get my glasses so much. I see a world on the side of you, so I don't know what emoji Put your glasses you have. on, they're right in front of you. Yeah, life with mommy. Berkey, I know Berkey, I know you t sent me a message. Yep, you did. I love you, mama, I love you. Hi. Okay, guys, we are, did anybody guess what we were making? I try to make it be fun and like riddle-like. It's a riddle. Do you guys know what we're making? <laughs> hey, Quirky. Where are they? Oh. Hey, Alpha, my beautiful boogie bear. He's got something there at his house that I want so bad. Hi. Yes, cheese. Cheese, yes. Don't you think those are little fun rhymes? Like, hey, Hedzos, hey, Emmy. I, wa I want to make one. Oh, yeah, you did make one on time. Okay, we're going to start, you guys. We are actually going to do, I know we could do the cornmeal, the flour, the baking powder, and the salt. And I know it's, like, shocking that we're not, but we're not. We're going this, why? Because my mom lives and breathes by Jiffy. And I love Jiffy. And if I didn't use Jiffy. How many you want to make? Five. Or six. Bro. Well, you have to ask me in front of everybody how many, uh, how many I'm going to eat. <laughs> I'm going to eat about, I'm going to eat about three. Okay. They're free. We're not at the fair. If I was at the fair, I'd be like, I'm only getting one. We'll share one. <laughs> yeah, we'll share one. We do do that when we go to the fair. Our town where we're at, that corn dogs go for seven dollars. I didn't say it. You just did. I said our town we're from. You said corn dogs. Oh, she's already guessed it. Oh, okay. She's guessed it. Joe, Joe's all upset because he thought I gave it away. We had one of our subs. We guessed it. Should I do one? I want there to be enough. Whatever we don't use, we're making, putting jalapenos in it and making it as an actual cornbread. Okay, everybody knows the, 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 it's an egg, milk. Okay, that's what we're doing. But uh, this is the part that's a little bit different for you guys. Joey, um, Nathan hot dogs are the best, but these are what we got. We're air frying them. If you want to boil them first, you can. If you want to cook them on the stove and get them hot, you can. We found that cooking the hot dog first before we dip it, it allows it. Freya! Hi, Mama! I love you. If anybody doesn't know, that's my friend's daughter, and I love seeing her, and I saw her comment earlier. Okay. Chingao? Where's the other wiener, Joe? Where? What? What? He bought it like this, minus one? No. Okay, if you can, if you remember, the way that you cook it, air fry it, I wouldn't microwave it because it gets rubbery. So you can either cook it on a stove with a little oil to get it golden, get it hot, put it in a little bit of water. But remember, if you're going to put it in water, you're going to have to dab it really good to get all the extra water off of there. Okay, because you want your batter to stick to it. You can air fry it. That's what Joe's doing. He's air frying behind me. Okay. Let's get ready to rumble. Just kidding, guys. I usually break up these because there's always clumps of it. If you guys do it with the cornmeal and all that, I mean, come on, y'all. I am respecting the game. I'm respecting the game. Don't worry. You're not going to insult me because you make your cornbread from scratch. Because if we were at the store, I would have bought all the stuff to make my cornbread from scratch. But because the mittens do not go out to the store, but once every two weeks, when we run dry on stuff, we run dry on stuff. But welcome in everybody. My alpha has got um, a big chunk of my love. My little grandson now gives grandma kisses. I wanna tell you guys, he gives grandma kisses now and it's the greatest thing ever. I can't show you all of it, but this is him puckering up. This is him puckering up to give Grandma a kiss. Stop it, you guys. My grandson puckers up to give Grandma a kiss. <laughs> I can't help it. I can't help it, you guys. There's nothing I can do. Okay, I saved this off of a different app I have. We have our convertible and we travel. Who do you think is that? Traveling with us in the back seat. She's got her air, she's got uh, no ears that flap down, so the convertible top down, 
actually hurts her. So we bought her a little band she puts around her ears and she's looking out the window or out the top of the, you know, it's a top down convertible. But anyways, that's my little friend, Bait Novi. I wanted to show you guys and I kept forgetting. I saved it off of an app where we have all of our pictures stored. And I was like, I gotta remember to show them. All right, you guys, let's go, let's go. I put two eggs in, it's one per box, and then a third cup oil. I'm gonna add a little bit of melted butter because we do that. A third cup, if you guys have your own recipe, use your own. We mainly wanted to show you a cool trick and that's microwaving it or grilling it because you do actually get a little bit of um, flavor. You add a flavor to it by doing something before you dunk it. And we put ours in a cup. I don't know if anybody's ever seen that little hack, but we're gonna fill up this with our corn ma, dog, what's it called? Corn, corn batter, corn dog batter. Yeah. And then, hand me a stick, or we use them all? You're right there. Oh, then when our hot dog is in there, we're gonna do this. It's, they're getting cooked right now in the- Air fryer. Thank you, baby. If you guys do the homemade, I, it, it is good. I really like Jiffy. Um, for me, Jiffy works because it reminds me of my mom. You guys, if you guys haven't been able to tell by now, I cook a lot of nostalgic. They remind me of my dad yesterday, the tacos, the shell. Um, my son used to, his favorite thing was the picadillo. Honestly, when I go to pick out menus, I really, really embrace the kids growing up. This was their favorite dish. Or my, when I make fideo, that was my daughter's favorite. So some people don't do that. I cook like that. I cook with my, my heart and it brings me back to moments that my dad, we were all sitting at the table and and that's what made me choose that one uh, yesterday was because my dad's birthday was Sunday and I wanted to have that memory of, of his tacos. So it, that's just how I cook, you guys. This reminds me of when the kids were growing up, we made homemade like hot dogs and corn dogs. We made the kids feel like even though we're not going out to eat, that were still, we had all the fixins. We had a little dish that had the pickles, that had all the cheese, so that they always felt like, and you wanna make it a little bit runnier than what it would be, guys. It'd be thick, you want it thick, but you want it a little tiny bit. Like I put a, one tablespoon extra, okay? Because when I pour it in here, I'm gonna pour it in and pull it out. Let's go, let's go. Chingao, how long, babe? I don't know. I'm going to test them out here. All right. Oh, I was going to put a little bit of... If you guys want to, do it. If you don't want to, don't. But I always put a teaspoon of sugar in my Jiffy. In my Jiffy, I put a little bit of regular granulated sugar. Two eggs. Two one-third cups. So I know that would be like a half a cup or whatever it is. But I do one-third a cup twice. And I put two eggs. Okay, because I'm using two boxes. You don't have to do the extra sugar. I like, my, you can add honey to it. There's, I, I have another recipe when I make it from scratch, I add honey to it and I add jalapenos to it. That's, that's kind of, we just kind of filter, uh, not filter, we kind of uh, shape it to the things we like. All right, when you go to see if it's gonna be the right uh, consistency put your spoon in and then drop it like that okay it, it would be if you've ever made jiffy or even if they make it homemade it's very it's usually a lot more um it's a lot more thicker <laughs> joe shut up joe shut up you know what i'm here for i need to help you through the hard times get out of the kitchen y'all tell him to leave the kitchen we're not wanting his help anyways at this point i've got it from here he's like <laughs> whatever thick i'm like you know what yeah joe that's the word i was looking for thick <laughs> yeah. hey he there's nothing wrong with thick everybody we all down for ain't the nothing thick. wrong with thick ain't nothing wrong yeah. with <laughs> joe i'm gonna punch your ass did you just do <laughs> I hate him. You know what? Get out of the kitchen for real, bro. I hate you. I'm going to punch this man. Sorry about me, baby. 
Giggle Goose, welcome in, Petunia, Belle Belle, try me. I know, Kay Breeze, you're gonna find this man, he like puts his arms around me like it's supposed to make it okay. Bro, that's like when a woman asks you like, hey, if I put some weight on it, the guy's supposed to go, I don't see it. No, I think it's good. As soon as the guy starts thinking, you literally want to knock him out. <laughs> I know. Okay, look, I'm going to put it in here, you guys. Get a cup that's going to be thick enough. And the reason that I'm using this one is because it's got to go like the hot dog is in. Just cure it. Like that. So you want to use the other one, Daddy? No, I was just, just going to say uh, just This it. one. No, that one's cool. That one's, that one's tall enough for sure. Yeah, is that tall enough? I'll do this one just so we don't have to put our hands all the way into the glass. All right. I got Chingo. You give me the uh, Whatever nervous. Whatever you want to do. You give me don't nervous. Don't listen to me. I'm nobody. You give me nervous action mode. And remember, you're going to dunk it. So leave room for your, um, what's that word called? The, yep. let, leave room for it to go up. Whatever that means. Like overflow-ish. Mm. Leave room for it to expand. No. Mm -hmm. Expand? Yeah. Okay, let's go, Joe. How long are those wieners? Oh, put more in there. More? Yeah, that ain't gonna span that much. You don't think? No. I'm glad I did two two ba bo yeah. boxes. There you go. All right. Now you don't have to dig down. I think we're probably pretty good. Get them. Get them over here now. Okay. Joe's putting them in the air fryer right now. It's optional. You can boil yours if you want yours in the air fryer. My Spitfire, Faya Johnson. Fe Freya Johnson. I know how to say that. Sorry about that. Petunia Pakovat. Joe's wearing a skirt. Joe, are you wearing a skirt? No. Yes. Oh, because the front of the apron. <laughs> I'm wearing an apron. Yes, Which Joe's. Kind of like a, a half of a Joe's Scott. Look at it. It does look like it. The back end of it's on my butt sticking out then. Joe's Scottish. I don't have a full skirt on. He's wearing Just shorts. Shorts. Oh, oh, what is that? Uh, da, 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 da. What is that? Uh, 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 uh. I don't know. What is it? Is that the chorus line? Mm -mm, oh, mm -mm. that's before my time. They kick up a lot higher than I can. Oh, that's oh, as high as I can kick. oh, yeah. Oh, that's it. The the ba the ba uh, yeah the legs. radio the radio hall. Uh, they're called something girls. Yeah, something. There's a something girls. Yeah, something. The show girls or something like that. <laughs> we don't know. We'll leave room for the displacer. <laughs> Not his dress, not a skirt. Mm. That's an easy like skirt. Joe is wearing a skirt. Hey, my God, Liz, he is wearing a skirt. Liz, Liz okay. freaking popped in just to say he is wearing a skirt. Okay. <laughs> the right. Rockettes. The Rockettes. The Rockettes. Uh, Leave it to freaking Liz. There you go. Liz has that. The, the full view, guys. Oh, sorry. Go ahead. I'm oh, sorry. They just, they just got it. They don't need no more. They can't handle <laughs> anymore. You're so dumb. I'm going to stab you with these. The Rockettes. Okay, yeah, this is what they, they're hot. Okay, this is what they look like. They're cooked. They're golden. And so they're going to be a little bit on the, um, a little bit on the shiny-ish. So we're going to roll it in a little bit of the flora. Como le flor. Every time I say flower, oh I God. start singing. <laughs> Selena. Stop. Selena. All right, you going to take over then? Well, I'm going to try. These All are right. hot. I don't want you to... Oh, Aw, Daddy, yourself. cut it out. You gotta be. I need water. Ooh, Joe's already got the hook up. Yeah. This is Dijon. There's one. I think. Come on. Come on, baby. Let me tell you, when your kids start asking for $7 corn dogs, and you know it's gonna take three of them. My son was a heavyweight wrestler. He wasn't heavy, but he just was, he was solid. He was a solid kid. <sighs> Let me tell you, one little corn dog is not gonna feed the boy. So, and you would go about how deep in? I'm going almost to the end. Almost to the end because you don't want it to jiggle off. Because we want to put this whole thing in the deep fryer. There you go. So we gotta have room for the deep fryer. Are we done over here, or do we have any? Uh, just no. There's nothing in there. Just if you want to shut it up. I'm gonna find you, bro. <laughs> the backless skirt. <laughs> Like Prince. <laughs> hey, I could be compared to worse. Oh my God, that's right, babe. That's you know what? That's a man. <laughs> I've been called way worse. That's I'm a sure. man confident in his sexuality. Wow. I've been called worse. <laughs> it is so hot. 
<laughs> he's, they, uh, you're an excellent penetrator. <laughs> <laughs> Had a lot of practice. Joseph, why do you have to add shit like what? that? Why? Oh, my word. Georgia Peach. So, let's see, I got to pull out on this one. Hold on. There we go. I know, Freya. Tell him something. There we go. He's got gonna, it. In so, the right hole that time. Okay. I'm going to knock this man out. <laughs> And then Joe just goes along oh, with it, Freya. That's even worse. 400 degrees. Holy smokes. What happened? What happened? All right. Let's, let's get it going. Ready? Yeah. All right. Come on. We're doing it. We're doing it. We're doing it. Make sure you're on live chat, y'all. These oh my are gosh. ready. Inappropriateness. Joe's always ready to go there. Let me tell you. Y'all should have seen when we were They will making, all fit in the pan. When we were making meatball sliders. I had to cut these babies down. Joe was so. They're about that long. It was wrong. We were making meatball sliders Ooh. and Joe's like, you just got to open up those buns and just slide that meat in. And I'm like, I will never make it again on the live with Joe because I literally was red, bloodshot red the whole live. But we do have a live of uh, meatball sliders if you want to look good <laughs> up. Okay. My mind is always in the gutter. Petunia, <laughs> so is my husband's. All right, let's go. Let's do it. Do it, do Am it. Am I doing it? Wait, uh, uh, oh, oh, flower yeah. first. Oh, flower first. Oh, here, I'll move them. All right, hold on. These are 90% cooked, guys. They're 90% cooked. So you don't have to get them almost pitch dark in order for them to wait are we ready uh, yeah okay i'm so scared okay scoot over and then you go and then i'll do the next one i wanted to see all my people berkey meatballs and a wiener yes <laughs> that's with our other one with our uh, midwest uh our midwest sauce with the grape jelly and ketchup we're little weenies and meatballs Oh, so All right, roll it in. Oh, you're scared. Holy mother of God. <laughs> Look at what Joe's doing for us. Yeah, I need the tongs. You yeah. better move that ass, baby. Oh, we need somewhere to put it on. I got you. I got you, baby. You know how happy a girl seen a corn dog? Woo -woo! I love corn dogs. And I know that I don't like paying the money they want us to pay over at the... We have um, a small town, so we had an, a, a county. I won't say what county, but we had a county fair. Joe, you better cut that out, bro. Oh, I love you. That's the flour. I'm shaking it off, so don't put that much. Okay, guys, because you don't want a big chunk of gummy in there. So just kind of like... Just, oh, God, that was oh, wrong. Yeah, don't do that. <laughs> don't sorry. do that. I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't realize it until I did it. Dang it. Sorry. Sorry. Sorry, everybody. We got the rack out Take here. Take it off the screen. I don't mean We got the rack out here. Here, move that rack so I can put it on there. Here, go backwards. Sorry, guys. Oh, I feel like a freaking freak. I'm sorry. That was the grossest thing I've ever done in my entire life. Shine. And you're laughing. Ugh. I feel even worse. Bro, I don't want mine that dark. I'm trying to get it out of there. Just squeeze the bun. The, the whole thing. Uh, Why don't you want to squeeze it? Because I don't want to. Okay. Ooh. Well, that's not too dark. That's just like... Okay, well, I like mine golden. Obviously, I like white. So make it as close to, oop, nope. You missed a spot. I missed a spot. Go I should have showed them what it looks like. Yeah, I showed them the first one. Oh, I mean, if you miss them. Oh, all right. Get it in there, baby. Okay, 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 okay. I'll do it. See you guys, spin it, spin it. I'm not incompetent. Oh. Look at how bubbly it gets, you guys. You give me anxiety. <laughs> Thank you, Berkey, for blessing. Y'all put bacon in there for bless Berkey blessing us. If you don't put it, you guys, just now I should have showed you, but it came up without uh, cornmeal or whatever that corn, corn stuff. Yeah. What is that called? Yeah. Your cornmeal batter. Yeah, the batter, the batter. 
It, so you will have to do something if you're going to cook them because the oils, you guys, the oils come out. Yes, I do. There you go. And then you just kind of drip it. Don't take too much off. You do want some of it. Drop it. You're going to have to go the front and 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 let the stick down gently that's the because if you drop it it's the weight of it will splash you know, there's this so you can throw it on there no uh yeah that might, that might work. we'll try it okay you're gonna have to take some of these to john wayne thought we were gonna need this many you can, you can just not make all of them you think so yeah okay We'll just do a couple each. Yeah. Take your golden one out. Golden, baby. Good boy. Good boy, Daddy. Okay. Okay, we're doing another one. Yeah, we'll do four. That should be enough. Okay. So when we're done with four, we're going to be like, why didn't we do two more? <laughs> Make sure you go all the way down so you'll have to roll it around to get it. Here. To get it to the end of the wiener or hot dog or whatever you guys call it. Frankfurter. Is that really what it's called? Frankfurter. I don't like that word. Frank's Frankfurter. Furter. Frankenfurter, just like uh, Rocker Horror Picture Show, if anybody remembers that. And then I'm doing this to it to kind of like shake some of the extra off. Yep. Spin it. And go. then I'm going to drop the front Let and it. take the. Let it sit for before it, it hits the yeah. bottom. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, let it sit in there, kind of get a get a crust on it first. And if you have something that you can like hold it up, but basically they're still going to get a little smashed because they are laying on a tray. They look good, honey. They look, yeah. I know. I'm just they saying. Oh, oh, this one's pretty. Woo -woo, woo -woo. I think you, they do need to get a little longer because that's why those did not, and this one did. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they need to be a little bit more. Just make sure that the dough is, or the batter is cooked through. Yes. So you want to have your fire not so hot. Yeah. So that way it's not overcooking the goldenness of it. But you don't need it really to do your wiener or hot dog or whatever you want to call it. You need to cook the batter. Yes, thank you, baby. Smack that. Never mind. <laughs> I'm so nervous to say anything. Whoop, whoop, whoop. I want to just show them. This is what I'm doing right now, guys. I'm like letting it drip off like that first. And then I will stand it up. So you just have to be cautious when you're doing that, that you're not dripping too much. Oh, are you okay, Daddy? <laughs> dripping too much off, but you don't want it to go. Look at See, there's still a little bit more. But don't do too much. I mean, it's actually just a... It doesn't have to be an inch thick, that's for sure. Yeah, and it's just a, a trial, and the longer you try making them again, yeah. you'll do better and better. Yeah, just is that is not that's like a eighth of an inch coating on that thing. Yeah, there ain't a whole bunch out there. You can almost see how thin yeah. it is right there at the bottom. Yeah, that's how thin it is. Drip in there. I got you. There you go. Perfect. Okay, guys. Whoop. There you go. Put the head in for. Oh Jesus! Uh, here. <laughs> Put the, the tip of. Oh shit! <laughs> Joe, shut up! God, I'm so uncomfortable with it. Put the wiener in there. I'm so Don't uncomfortable, I swear. Let me just talk to people where I feel safe. This is my safe place. Tater, hey, man and papa. It's good to see you. Tater, Berkey, Lizzie. I'm, I like them thick. Lord. Lord. Why did I read that out loud, Liz? I hate you. Halloween, baby. Petunia. Oh, my God. I'm so uncomfortable saying any. Oh, shit. And she's had to catch that. Oh my god, I'm so embarrassed. He's like, put that tip in first. I don't even know what to say. I'm so uncomfortable with it all. Put the end of the Frankfurter Shit. into the oil. I don't want to say any of it no more. <laughs> I'm so uncomfortable. It's... Shit. Just stick the thing that's on the stick in there. <laughs> 
from Petunia Burger. Kimikaze, welcome, welcome in. You guys, I didn't want to say any of those words. And y'all are putting them in the damn chat is worse. Shit balls. That, oh, shit, that's worse. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you don't want that either. I don't want any of it. Let, let, uh, why do we make these damn corn dogs? Whose damn idea was that? <laughs> All right. You guys, that's you want to... Let's go. That's enough. You guys, you know how sad I was? My. This um, one, does this even need to go back in? Try it. Try it. You guys, my, um, I forgot to tell you guys, my... This one needs a double fry. My tall... Oh, and you can do that if you want it extra crunchy. Put it for like two minutes yep. and then take it out and do it for another three to four minutes to get it extra crunchy on the outside. That's what we're going to do with this one. Um, my glass that my tall 20 or 24 ounce glass that had like a silicone cover on the top and... And it was my favorite one. I put it in the freezer and there was nothing, there was nothing in it. It was empty. It was just, I was just chilling the glass so I could have a cold glass of tea or water. And my glass cracked. Oh, so sad. I was sad. All right. Oh, oh yeah, my friends. I forgot, I forgot to say hi to them. Berkey. Night, Georgia Peach. Thanks for coming in. That spoon is done. Hey, cheese. <laughs> Leave the spoon alone, okay? Oh, my God, it is. Cheese, <laughs> shut up. You jinxed it. <laughs> oh it my still gosh. works. You guys, this is actually um, one, of our, one of our subs. I love her so much, Pixie Girl. She got us the pan set last summer, um, and that was the first time. We had had, uh, we've been in the RV from 28, 2020, we came in the RV. Oh my God, that spoon is done. Um, 2020, we RV'd, uh, so then 2023, the pans were three years old. And thank God she sent us a set of these pans. And then um, the, are we moving them? Yes. And then, um, so then, uh, turn that, oh, hey guys, hold on. So then, um, I love my pixie girl. She does, she's really busy. She just Is this moved. real stuff? Yeah, that's yours. Um, but anyways, so um, I felt so bad. And then our stand, we didn't have a stand. You guys were always in one of our shelves up here. So we were cooking stuff and the phone would always, you guys fell into like a pan of stuff all the time. Or you guys always fell into a pan that we were dropping it. It was so awful. I mean, it wasn't funny, but it was awful. And then Milltown sent us the the stand. Thank God. Uh, it, we've come a long ways with our channel, you guys. We were always dr like, let's just tink. Y'all get the heck out of here. Come on. Okay, let's put it on a pretty plate so we can, oh, we can do it on here. Stop. Oh my gosh, you guys, stop it. Right now, just stop. Tell me your kids are not going to be excited that you're having homemade corn dogs. Woo, woo! <laughs> I'm excited. I'm excited for that. All right. Let's do it. All right. I need, um... Ooh, that's good. Ooh. Uh, We're going to okay. do a mix? Yeah. So it's got to go <laughs> in together. Ready? Yep. I got it. Let's do a tink. Everybody get the forks up. We're tinking already. Tink. Let's go. Uh -huh. You guys, how long was that? 30 minutes you guys had homemade and you saved yourself $28. This is uh, Dijon and regular mustard mixed and this is and i'm going to put a little ketchup in there too a 50 50 mix yeah tink tink, tink. stop tink mm. Mm. Uh -oh. 
Mm-hmm. That's pretty good. Perfect amount. That's pretty good. Perfect. And it's right against there. There's no gap in there. I've gotten them before where there's gaps. Mm-hmm. You guys, one... We did two boxes. They were 65 cents each. Mm. Yeah. Push them to the top. Oh, yeah. The corn... The muff, the corn muffin mix was sixty five cents. We bought two, so it's a dollar thirty. The hot dogs cost it three fifty. Yeah, those are three fifty for four dollars. You can have eight corn dogs, eight corn dogs, you guys. I mean, it's not that your kids don't want to go down to the to the carnival or whatever, but how fun is that that the kids are gonna have corn dogs on the weekend? It's their birthday. Do you buy pizzas at somebody's birthday? Like, let's make corn dogs. I like that. I like the kids to feel like it's a special occasion when it's really just a regular, a, a Tuesday night. Look, it's Tuesday. Mama cannoli. Don't drown your food in mustard or sauce. <laughs> Schoolhouse rocks. <laughs> Try me kamikaze petunia spitfire. Yeah, that is when dad watched me and he drools like a, a bulldog petunia. <laughs> I love that. I love that. Thank you, M thank you, Milltown. I saw M. You guys, I'm a nutcase. Thank you, Milltown. Try me, bitch. Got one. Woo -woo. Thank you, thank you, thank you, guys. We are beyond blessed that you guys come. You guys try different recipes. We are beyond blessed that you give us a chance. Thank you guys so, so much. If you guys have any questions, email us. Our email's up there. Thank you, thank you, all of my amazing friends. Allie, Allie! Um, I love all my, my friends. I know their names. Thank you guys for coming in. I really, really appreciate it. I needed to see you guys. Liz, Liz. Ooh, well, William, welcome. You're a new subscriber. You're from Brooklyn. Hey, I like that. Hey, what's up? I like that. I love all of you guys, but I love new subscribers just because I love knowing that somebody else is going to check it out. Some, I'm helping people save money. And you know what, you guys? I got the most amazing, the most amazing um, compliment. For me, I felt like it was a really nice compliment. And I know a lot of you guys have said this stuff like this before, but it just made me feel so nice. I want to read one to you that made me feel really good. He said... I thought you were going to say you had an amazing husband. I have an amazing husband. He said, hello, y'all. I usually that? catch your replay. I've been subscribed to your channel from when y'all started sharing your cooking streams. Extremely enjoyable. I always leave a thumbs up, but I hardly ever post. He said, my wife and I just learned this stream, how simpler it is to create deliciousness. Like... I know that a lot of people tell me that they cook my stuff and I know a lot of people tell me now, now they use it. But I mean, just to like know somebody's been watching for over a year, but that it they now that the the simplicity, the simplicity of like we only have seven dollars. What can we my what can we make for dinner? You guys can make homemade corn dogs. Your kids will think that you guys are rock stars. I mean, we raised three kids. Well, we raised two. One of them was older, but there's, you never want them to know it's a tough week. We're paying all these bills this week. We're paying extra bills this week. We're putting extra money in our savings account. So you really still want to. that shit when they're older, they're like 25 years old. And you go, you remember those corn dog nights? <laughs> okay. Because we didn't have no damn money. <laughs> so anyways, what my, my point is that you make homemade pizzas and they think it's the greatest thing ever, but you didn't have to spend $45 on pizzas. You could make homemade pizzas with $12 and it was great. You, you're able to like have these special moments that you're not even busting the bank for you're, but you're good, but you're giving them great. Like our kids remember having, um, hot dog night or having, um, nachos, like literally yeah, just baseball nachos, games. baseball games. They knew that we, we, we even wrap wrapped them up, them up and <laughs> we wrapped up foil on them. Oh, yeah. The kids thought it was the coolest thing ever. So yeah. I just, I really, um, it's, 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 it's fun. It's fun to make memories. It's free to make memories. Remember that it's free to make memories. I mean, 
you you won't ever my daughter's in budapest right now and you know what she's telling me and it was funny she said it it was the same week that my son said it she said mom i got a donut over here she said i was drinking my donut and i got the chocolate milk and i sat there on the bench in you know in budapest she's getting her masters she said i sat back and i started thinking it felt like home because every every morning I, we would drop off our my son at school and we had an hour in between instead of driving home i'd go to the local bakery i got a bread muffin or a donut and we split it we uh, we just it was just cost efficient for us to split the donut or to split the bran muffin and we drank it or we ate the donut and we shared the chocolate milk and he said she said mom it just reminded me of home it just so happened that my son like two or three days later my son said mom he's got his, his son he's a year and a half old and he said i took papa's to go and get some a donut this morning he goes i still remember those times on the way to school we would pick it up and we would have that like was it the healthiest thing no probably not were other parents buying their kids yogurt and healthy granola bars probably but you know what i have i have my both of my kids in the same week they gave me that nugget of memory that i needed you know like I, it's nobody's comparing you to be a mom to somebody else it's what works in your home you know what I mean? It works in your house. It doesn't matter that it doesn't work in the Everybody Jones's up? house, in the Smith's house, in, in five houses down. For me, it works because today my son's almost 30. My daughter's almost 26. And you know what they have? Memories. They have memories. <laughs> I hate you. I don't remember salads with my mom. <laughs> exactly, Liz. Just, I just just know that you know the reason i do these uh watching when when we lived in our home in michigan we had a five bedroom home we, it was an amazing home we lived in a five bedroom cul-de-sac beautiful neighborhood we didn't have to cut corners i liked cutting corners okay, go ahead. i felt like i was getting more out of that groceries i don't want to spend 140 because I didn't use any coupons. I want to spend 140 because I have enough groceries to last me the whole month. And I want to be able to go this weekend to go watch movies with the kids and we'll go to the nine or the 10 o'clock and it's called the fall, fall winter series or whatever it was and they were free. But who cares? We made the memories because we saved the money on not buying crazy groceries with no, with no coupons. So do what works for you, but I try to give you these, this like, uh, not hints, these, these cooking secrets or cooking tips. So that way you guys will have, you guys can give, that's what Joe said. Like I'm showing you guys how to make spaghetti sauce and pizza sauce. So if your daughter's ever away at college and all she has is $3, a box of noodles and a can of spaghetti or uh, tomatoes, a can of tomatoes will give her marinara or spaghetti sauce if you don't show them they're not going to go to college and know how to do it trust me i found that out my daughter's like mom i don't know what to do with our faucet it's doing this well guess what i showed her how to cook and bake and all that but nobody showed my daughter how to work on the plumbing joe worked on it but he didn't say hey destiny come here let me show you this so i said all that to say we have the opportunity to stuff shove stuff in their heads and you just want to take as much time to do it as you can. Yeah. Yes, cheese. We did that at the at the drive-ins too. What? Bucket take, of chicken? We just took stuff in there. That's what my mom and dad yep. used to do with us. She That's said, what we did with our kids too. My mom used to put us in the trunk and sneak us. We did that growing up. I mean, I'm, <laughs> I'm 50. We would, all of our girlfriends would climb into the well, trunk of a it. Case of courts in the back, but. <laughs> well, we were in That's high what was school. In our trunk. When we were in high school, everybody yeah. would climb in the back of the truck. Two people would pay, and the whole trunk, there'd be like six people in the trunk. I'm not even lying. It was fun. Anyways, be blessed, you guys. Have an amazing, amazing night. We will see you guys probably tomorrow. I'm not 100% sure. Yeah, I love you guys. My grandpa puts us in boxes in the back of the truck to sneak us into the drive-in. Yeah, I wish to, my dad would have done we that. We take our kids to the... Well, Dust would fall asleep, but uh, we'd have a bucket of chicken, or we'd we'd make our own food, sandwiches, whatever. 
back the truck up. Mm -hmm. Everybody sit in the back truck where we have lawn chairs out there. We had a pickup truck. Yeah. And we would just put the seats up there, our lawn seats. Yeah. <laughs> Jeez, many of us were welfare babies. We didn't have welfare back then. We ate a lot of beans. My mom would send me to school with bean tacos. I'm like, bro, I'm not opening my bean tacos. So then the next day she sent me with egg salad tacos and a metal lunchbox. It smelled like a fart. I was Funny. like, why would my mom give me something that I'm gonna have to explain to everybody? I'm like, they're like, gross, who farted? I'm like, oh my God. I was, cause I didn't really pay attention. I was only eight or 10 years old. And my mom thought it was like, it was a stupid holly hobby a stupid holly hobby lunch box that was metal and the front of it had like a little clasp like that i was dead i couldn't believe my mom did that she's like you said you didn't want to send she didn't even know it was embarrassing she goes you said not to send you with bean tacos okay but don't send me with fart tacos either oh my god All right, you guys i love you guys be blessed home. have a good night you guys thank you guys for coming in Ooh, a cup of soup for lunch. That was Joe's whole time at at, at work. Oh, yeah. Thank you, guys. Share us, please. Hit the like on your way out. Thank you guys so much. Thank you for coming in. Thank you for sharing memories with us. I absolutely love you guys. Food to stick into the metal lunch bags. Girl, yes. That's, girl, yes. It's stunk in those metal boxes. <laughs> I love you guys. Be blessed. Cardboard, rectangle, yeah. cardboard, school beats. Oh, I miss those. I love those square ones. In the Midwest, we used to have chili and a cinnamon roll. Believe it or not, there's a lot of people that dunk their cinnamon roll in it. Joe, uh, did you guys do that? No. It must have just been our school. Pizza we did school? it. Yeah, we had pizza, the square, just a big pan pizza, just hamburger. There's my mom. She's the culprit. And cheese, yeah. Hamburger and cheese pizza. But oh, yeah. then you'd when you got the, they were like no big cookies, but they did them in a sheet. We didn't get any cut square? Them in squares. Oh my God! Y'all, there's would the trade and try to get those things. They were so good. There's, we, I never got any. There's the culprit who made me go to school with fart sandwiches. Thanks, Mom. You gave me quite the childhood memory. <laughs> I love you for it, Mom. I love you guys. Be blessed, y'all. Oh, we have PayPal, Zelle, Cash App, Venmo. Hook, hook us up if you can. If you can't, right, just come back tomorrow. When we cook again. Wanna see that one first? Okay, we can see Fat Girl. That one. Fat, fat Girl! girl. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. Daddy, don't tease her with that finger. <laughs> now I gotta go wash that finger. <laughs> <laughs> Fart sandwiches next live. <laughs> I hate you, Liz. <laughs> <laughs> Tune in next how to for how to protect your part. Too. How to get the perfect <laughs> smell on those fart tacos? <laughs> oh my God, mom! Um, all right, I love you guys. Be blessed. Uh, hit the like. Hit the share. Wait. Yeah. Like Do and all share. That stuff. I know. Hit like and share. And subscribe. Subscribe. I was gonna say it again. Subscribe. Hit the share. Hit the likes. Oh, thank you, Halloween baby. You are a blessing, mama. Thank you. Hit the likes, hit the shares. Well, you know what I mean, y'all. Just do whatever you can do. Yeah, do this. All right? Do the stuff. Y'all, if y'all know how to do the stuff, do the, do the stuff. stuff. Bacon, bacon, bacon! And we got to do the it's bacon. Bacon! Joe, you do it better than the music. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't know what to do if I didn't have you doing that. I'm telling you. All right, you let's put bacon. You wouldn't know what to do without we'll me. That's didn't, what you're really I, trying I, to say. I was going to say, I didn't say that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I know what you mean, though. It's okay. Thank you, Halloween baby. Thank you, Shine. Thank you, Berkey. Aw, Shine, thank you for going bacon, along bacon. with the bacons. Bacon, bacon, bacon. You guys are all a blessing. Petunia. Prison, prison pickle? Prison pickle? Aren't you? What? Huh? Okay. I love you. I'm confused. I'll text you. I love you guys. Be blessed.